Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the lands of Mrauk, you and the continuing adventures of Frigoberto de Valencia. I am Marcus Aurelius, and this is Suvanapum Mahayud, a mod for Mount and Blade Warband. And we are where we want to be. We are surrounded by headhunters and mercenaries and enemies who want to kill us and take all that we have, but it is giving us experience and glory and renown. So in previous episodes, we have recruited a number of support cast to our party, Davi the Raider, Winhimu the Tactician, Lurkin the Huntress, and Tipsuda the Healer. So far, everybody gets along except for Lurkin and Tipsuda. And considering Lurkin is the only one who really survives the battles, I, you know, I would like to keep them both, but... I don't know if I'll be able to do that. So, we have troops from numerous nations. All fighting together for the common good. These Arachanese guys look badass. Oh, the Johorian guards. Look at how awesome these guys are. I like it. I like it a lot. Alright, so we're going to try to find some mercenaries to murder. My men would like a word with you about your personal or belongings. So, apparently, he thinks he can take me. Maybe he can. I don't know. Infantry? I'm sorry that I'm fighting all these battles at night. I don't really mean to. Oh, cavalry, no. No cavalry. Don't be foolish. Don't throw your life away! Oh, man. Frigoberto's messed up. He's ready to die. We're going to hang around with the range troops today. Even though it's nighttime. Oh, that didn't do any good at all, did it? Don't worry. I got this. Frigoberto has this. Yeah. Nice. Come on, everyone. Form up. Form up. The bulk of them are coming. Man, my ranged troops are not particularly effective. The enemy are all around us. Oh, come on. Load the gun. Here they come. Blow the gun! Oh, what a waste. Out of my way. That's a nice pot you have on your head there, buddy. Hey, you're Japanese. What are you doing? Alright, this is a bad day for Frigoberto. Oh, okay. Thank you, men. Thank you, men, for saving me. Alright. Everyone, finish him off. Charge! Wow, Portuguese? Oh, Frigoberto. Always biting off more than you can chew. Come on. I love how these guys can't even touch me. Like, I'm not blocking. They just can't get through my armor. Oh, man. He almost died, though. Oh, man. I love it. I love it. He's Frigoberto. Frigoberto de Valencia. Leading men from nations wide. With his honor, he will turn the tide. Lead Frigoberto. Yeah. And we have a someone we captured. Oh, wow. All of our heroes are down for the count. 
pretty much everyone is in bad shape. Let's see here. Anything worthwhile? Painted shield? Nothing really. I'll even take the turban. Alright, we need to make it to a city to sell some things. The closest city is at Maroc U. It appears that it is. Or Chittagong. We have yet to beat a Chittagong. If we could just... There's another Portuguese settlement. If we can just get around the headhunters. Although we are far stronger. So Mac Dynasty is declaring war against Lanzang when they're practically gone. Lana has declared war against the Mac. It is not going to be the return of the Mac, friends, because they are having some trouble. Manipur is against the Mac. Okay, a lot of stuff going on. Big things going on in the world. We're just going to try to get to Chittagong through the back door. Rangamati. Then we can check out Imphal. Lanka. Oh, I like that. Or Lamka. Thought it was like from the Demon Nation. Oh boy, hurry up. This is why pathfinding is important. Alright, Chittagong. Manipuri Rider, no. Portuguese, no. Man, if I'm this good in this armor, that uh, Italian armor must be unstoppable. Hi, Zia. What do you want? What do you have for sale? Bows. Not interested. Can you teach me something? Bows. Not interested. Lame. All right, goods. We are going to sell. Are we going to sell this shield? It's a bigger shield than this one. Less resistance, though. Less weight, but it has more durability. And higher speed rating. We'll hold on to this one, though. All right. Get rid of the Shan. Well, we might want to hold on to that for our companions. No, we need the money. Maybe our companions will want the... Golden Shoes. Wow, that's not bad. We're doubling our money. I like it. Thick Ken Round Shield. This one looks pretty awesome. Masterwork Hand Cannon. Bent Matchlock Pistol. I really would like to trade my rifle for a pistol at some point opportunity. Maybe a mace. A one-handed mace, so we can take prisoners. Is there anything like that? No, that's Pierce. Oh, whatever. Alright, let's take a walk around the streets, maybe meet the Guildmaster. I think we might be staying here for a while. Hello. This place looks pretty cool. There's the Guildmaster. Master Monk. Did not know that they had beards. Maybe he's a Portuguese convert. Do you happen to have a job for me? No. Bounty jobs are terrible. You have to look for them all over the world and you never find anything. So what we are going to do is we're going to wait here for a day or two just to get our men healed up. Oh, good! Good! So basically, our dye works at Malacca pays for our entire party. So if we can only afford to have businesses everywhere, could you imagine the money that Frigoberto would be making? Alright, when daylight comes. Oh, wow! Now that we have Davi the Hunter, we're getting tons of food, too. That's great. Alright. Let Frigoberto go out. And find an enemy to kill. More Naka. Yeah. They're like, yeah, we probably shouldn't do this. And they are faster than me, unfortunately. Oh, boy. Okay, see, now they're brave. Now that there's three groups of them. They always hang around in packs. How much would this be total? 16 plus 29, 45... 50, they be stronger than me. Let's do it. Everything has a price. Let's do it. I'm gonna lead my troops. Alright, not that it ever works, but 
Let's go infantry up front, archers in the rear. My archers are pitiful. Like, they should be mowing down the enemy, but they are not. What do we got in cavalry? We have a Manipuri Skirmisher and a Manipuri Arambai Hunba. He's Frigoberto. Frigoberto de Valencia. Uh, holding the Naka back with his might. For the people he will fight. Fight Frigoberto. Yeah, come on. Are they coming? Do they want any of this? They don't want any of this. I don't think they're ready. I don't think they're ready for this. Hmm. Infantry, move up. Archers, move up. Cavalry, move up. Whoa, hello. I ain't afraid of you. You won't be getting my head. Just charge. Things are falling apart. Nice, Davi. I'll take the guys in the back. Or maybe I won't. Oh! What's up? You don't scare me, headhunter. It's all your friends with the ranged weapons that are scaring me. There we go. Bring it. My head is not for you to hunt. Hey, you know what they say, man. Frigoberto has a good head on his shoulders. <laughs> yeah. Come on. Nice. Good work, men. Protecting the innocent villagers of this land from these crazed headhunters. Wow, we, we lost 13 people. An armored bestiero. Wow. These guys are rough. These guys are really rough for, for headhunters. Oh, we gained another level. Awesome. Ayuthian Vanguard. Wow, yeah. You are ready to go. You are ready to just tear things up. Marksman. All right, good. But they have nothing. There's, I'm not going to make money against these guys. Maybe if I could take some prisoner. Maybe. Lurkin, what can you do for me? I might end up losing you. So how about... How about power draw? At least I'll make you a valuable archery candidate. Okay. Davi. Actually, let's make you stronger too. And is that a two-handed weapon? I'm not quite sure, so for right now, we're just going to train you in archery. Windmew. More strength, more iron flesh, more polearm. You are all polearm all the way, and I love you for it. Okay, veteran. Footman. All right, good. Let's see what Frigoberto can do. All right, he's at strength 15 already. We could put charisma up to 12. We don't need trade, but we could use more leadership. And that will give us four leadership. Okay, we'll get charisma up to 12 next. That'll be our plan. And... More prisoner management? Eh. More surgery. We're losing a lot of guys to death, and Frigoberto's our best surgery. Let's get some firearms training. Excellent. We're pretty beat up. We are pretty beat up. They have uh, two leaders, seven veterans. Oh, whatever. Everything has a price, even your life. That's probably not what a headhunter would say, but all right, let's get the high ground. We have a ranged advantage. Let's use it. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Infantry, here. 
Archers. Here. Cavalry. Off to the side. Alright. Yeah, I wasn't expecting that to serve any purpose. Infantry, what are you doing? What? Archers? No, wh what? Okay. Plan has been broken. Everybody. Everybody charge. Just charge. Okay, bad tactical decisions here. Very bad tactical decisions. Oh, man. And Frigoberto's not on his game today. Wow. I got a spear to the chest, I guess. My men are too spread out. We appear to be winning. All right. They didn't need Frigoberto at all. These guys are a well-oiled machine. We did lose six, however. Three of our armored bestieros. Oh, man. Our Portuguese marksmen. Our best troops, basically. At least we have a musket man. Oh, yeah. A caravan guard with a water buffalo. Really? If we can get one of these guys. Okay. Sure. We'll hire the headhunter. Why not? Portuguese Marksman is literally the best ranged troop you can get for the Portuguese. There's just no money in this. There's no money in killing headhunters. I like killing headhunters, but I think I may have to come back later. And right now we need to go take on the Ming rebels. I think that's what I want to do. Let's go up to Imphal and through here. Through to Lana. Let's do that, and hopefully not get killed on the way. There's a lot of Nakamuradas there. Well, not, we won't win that. Well, we might, but... Oh, well. These guys are everywhere. But we cannot run them. Let's see what kind of troops Imphal gives us. Manipuri Levy. Okay. Churchandpur? Is that a city or a... No, that's just a fortress, okay. They only have one city, I guess, and that is... Imphal. Well, I guess that makes sense, doesn't it? Go free, go, Berto, go, go. Alright, let's see if we can recruit anyone interesting. Oh, hi, Lurkin. Okay, we have a smuggler. A traveler. A ransom broker. Portuguese mercenary. Two of them. Yeah, yeah, I know all about what you're doing. That's fine. Oh, God, that's nothing. Oh, okay, so it's like magic item. Yeah, no, I don't have the money to deal with that. You know what? I do have the money to buy something, though. And I doubt I'd ever be at war with these guys. Let's see. Knights and Imphal. Lurkin, you're cool and all, but I kind of preferred having Winhimu. He was... He was a tank. I liked him. Okay, he's not up here. There's the horse merchant. Oh, my horse is probably lame now that I think about it. He's Frigoberto. Looking for the guild master. Hello, sir. Oh, you know and trust me. Well, that's good. So, let's see. A weavery? 78 gold a week? No. Oh, we can't even afford that? Oh, we probably can't. You're right. You need like 7,000 for these kind of things. Rice mill? 66 a week? I mean, I could buy that, but that's just stupid. Sato? 27? No. Tannery? 232. It's not bad. But I cannot afford it. No, I can't afford anything. I need, we need to go fight the Ming. We need to go fight the Ming, and we need to make some money. In fact, I should be looking around here trying to find hidden chests. That's what I should be doing. I don't know if there's one in every city. I bet you money there's one, though, in Ayutthaya. 
definitely going to be one in Malacca. Finding a good gun would be the way to go. Okay, we're clear on that end. It is nighttime, so I cannot see anything. But I know what they look like. They're just chests. Okay, over here. Hello? No. That would be a good place for one, though. That seems like a good hiding spot. Nothing up here. He's Frigoberto. Searching for a chest amidst the ground. Hey, this this looks interesting. This looks like it might lead somewhere good. Nope. Find that chest, Frigoberto. Oh. Sorry, Lurkin. I got you caught there, didn't I? Okay, nothing there. Maybe over here. Some barrels. A wagon wheel. Interesting. No, just a dead end. Yet another good place to hide a chest, though, if you were going to do that. Let's see here. Okay. Weaponsmith. Some random stuff here. No. Let's look down here. It's the only way I can make money is by finding this hidden stuff and selling it. Hello? No, I don't want to leave the area. No. Maybe here? No. No. Doesn't look like... Doesn't look like it's over here. Okay. If it is here, Frigoberto will find it. Hello. Hello, armor. Have you seen a random chest lying around that I could perhaps loot? See, they might put it in a barrel. I don't know if there's rules to this. Like, I don't know if it has to look like a chest. Or if it could be a barrel. Can I get up on the roof? Okay. A lot of good hiding spaces here, definitely. Let's see what's over here. No? Not gonna let me? No. And I could just be wasting my time. It's possible this town does not have one. Last unexplored area. Okay. I guess the Manipuri are cheap. They don't want to give me amazing items. That's the prison. Alright, that's pretty much it. I've been through this entire place. There is a chest here. It is hidden beyond the abilities of my perception to locate it. Go to the shop. Yeah. It is hidden well. Alright, well, whatever. We've made it to Imfall, so now we must try to... Get out of here. You know what? I should be saying hi to lords that I walk up against. Just to get to know them. Stand and deliver. Oh, crap. Alright. One last battle before the end of this episode. And I think we're going to have a hard time. Let's have everyone just stay here. I don't, I don't see any benefit, to be honest, in having my range troops behind my melee troops. They don't do any good anyway. But at least here we're up kind of... There we go. There we go. There they are. 
I actually hit something. <laughs> That's amazing. And it bumped up my proficiency in firearms 10 points to 106. That's amazing. Come on, guys. Get him. Nice. They're doing really well. Now. Come on. Reload that. Don't back up. Doesn't matter how slow you go, as long as you don't stop. Nice. All right. Charge in. Rigoberto has to be careful. Our elephant is doing its business. Hey, you leave my elephant alone. Nice. Excellent. Frigoberto is an amazing tactician. Two killed. Levy tribesmen, that's okay. And we have a prisoner. Portuguese veteran. Still, though. Tipsuda, level three. Awesome. Let's get you up to Iron Flesh. And you have one handed weapon, I'm pretty sure. Although I would like you to be better at archery. That would be really cool. Marksman, excellent. The more of those guys I have, the better. Skirmishers or footmen? Let's go with skirmishers. Actually, then we can. Oh, that'll go to. Ah, damn it. I didn't know they were going to be cavalry. Oh well. So, I could go to Ava. I could. Or, I could go to Mong Quang. Is Bamo a city? Wow, the Shan have a lot of cities. No, that's just a castle. Okay. Where's Mong Quang? There it is. That's definitely a city, though. What I eventually want to get over here. Ish. Wow, the Mac are just getting nailed. And Lan, Lan Zhang or Lan Shang are just destroying everything. Alright, so yeah, so I'm just going to head. I'll skip Mong Kawa and go to Ava. And then from Ava, I'll go to. Kang Tung, and then Chang Sein, Luang Prabang, and then to the lands I want to go. But that will have to be in a future episode. So, once again, ladies and gentlemen, I am Marcus Aurelius. This is Savanapum Mahayud, Frigoberto de Valencia. Thank you so much for watching. Have a good one.